Uh, okay, Paul, keep telling the story. Mm. Mm. So it's set in the future, and... The year is 2001, and we have one hell of a setup. Real sexy stuff. <laughs> go ahead, Paul. Go ahead. Go, go. Okay, there's a, there's a group of revolutionaries, and they're hiding out on a moon base. And there's only one answer. Gentlemen, I want to thank you for attending this emergency security session. This visual report will illustrate our problem. Recent intelligence reports indicate that a band of youthful revolutionaries have set up a secret base in the far out region of the dark side of the moon. Their leader is a man who is known as Mr. E. His many followers regard him as a great poet, orator, inventor, and expert in martial arts. He appears to be leading his group in training exercises, which we believe are linked to a plan to attack Earth, to spread his dangerous anarchistic philosophy. Not since our troubles began way back in May 1968 have we seen such a cause for concern. Most distressing are the reports that he has developed a top secret weapon, which we feel we must capture to preserve our way of life. Gentlemen, we're left with only one option. To use agent code name Dragonfly. Oh, but she's so expensive. So much and work. so difficult. I know she's exasperating, but we need her. Now, I've arranged a teleconference. Please, Agent Dragonfly, we had an appointment. I need my sleep. We need to get down to business. Okay. What is it? Your mission is to infiltrate the community by whatever means available. Find Mr. E and take possession of his weapon. Mm. He's pretty cute, isn't he? Please, are you prepared to accept this mission? I'll take the mission. But you know how much I cost. Of course. So, are you prepared to take this mission? <laughs> well, if you can meet my price. No. <laughs> no, it sounds like fun. I love science fiction and I could probably make this amazing. 